one. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Round Table is Magic. I'm the Red and Black OC. It's been a while since I did this. And what we do on here, we talk about lots of stuff. We talk about anime, movies, TV shows, the shebang, the works. And today on the show, we have another special guest, Matt Radio. Welcome, welcome aboard to my show. And what are we talking about? God of War. Matt, the table is yours. Uh, okay. So, there will be other things about... Hardly remember what happened in the God of War series of the game. Also, the story mode of it. I am familiar with the old games and the new one, but go on. So, Heroes goes on an adventure. Well, not really. Kind of. But he goes on, like, a lot of events where enemies try to kill him, no matter what. Even though he has anger issues. And the other side of the real God of War, and practically, because Kratos became the God of War in the new series of the game. Hmm. Or it'd be unstoppable so everyone can just fight him and he'll be the greatest enemy of all time, and he got cursed. <laughs> How that happened? Also, another Mortal Kombat, which is a crossover. Yeah, I've seen one of those before. Of course, because he's, he's a god and he's, and he's mortal. I know he's immortal and he's a god. But he has also had a companion in the new game. He's called Boy. Everybody said it, it was his son. I don't believe that's his son. I think that's just Boy. Hmm. If it was his son, he would call out his name. Well, I never. But he calls him. Well, I never played the new God of War, so. In it, Jacksepticeye played it. Go look him up. He played it before. Oh, um, I'm already described to Jacksepticeye, so I've been paying attention. Oh, that's good. Cause he played the new game. Hmm. I did read the comics before. Comics? Mm hmm. Oh. They were not that bad. Yeah, they're not that bad. Actually, I never read the comics. Hmm. And I did play one of the old God of Wars for the old system. Played it on the um, PlayStation 2. Oh, that's very old then. <laughs> yeah. Xbox 360 is like PlayStation 3. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Xbox has found its days. So, I am go on. That's coming out though. Hmm. Which is Borderlands 3 coming out in 2019. So, any more on this guy? Kill many guys. 
that. Like what? What says pal? What does his sword do? Get two um, daggers. Those are big ones. Um, with chains on them, and kills everyone with them. Obviously. Of course. I mean, he done that in Mortal Kombat, and sometimes he lets them dangle around, or he holds them um, with his weapons. And what is his mission to do? His mission was to save his brother, but he died, so he put, like, red tattoo on him. Hmm, interesting. Like, honor his brother. Mm-hmm. And he still wears it till this day. Hmm. And now, but in the new game, it's like... I am calm anymore. And he now an axe, apparently, that can, like, be like Thor, can, like, be Thor's hammer, apparently. And he can, like, throw it and then come, make it come back to him. <laughs> That's about it, about this axe. About his weaponry, his skills, everything. And I guess he's from Valhalla, I guess. Yep, even from the Greek mythos. <laughs> oh, let's see, anything from my side about him? Uh, mm, like I said, I played one of the old games before, but not the new one. I did see Mark play it before. Yep. Yeah. Uh, reaction to it. Mm. It jacks up the guy. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what else about this guy? Uh, What does his artist tattoos mean? I don't know his brother. Sweet. Uh, I've been listening to Death Battle, apparently. And <laughs> we all have. Yes. Good memory of what they said about him. I'm only interested in the fight, but I sometimes listen to what they have to say about the character. How about his um backstory or his or his origin story? He was just a young man until he wanted power and fear on people's hearts. He succeeded on doing that, but there was a cost to it. Real God of War put a curse on him after that, for that debt. Kratos wanted to get revenge on him and wanting to kill him. I'm doing so, which i never seen the whole story mode of the game. At all times. And I never made theories about it. Very, very interesting. But go on. What? I said go on. Mm. Very interesting okay. about his backstory. I think he killed the sun god. Hmm. Or, you know, like, his eyes are glowing and he can make anyone blind with it. Yeah, I, I do remember that. He uh, like, carry a lot of the heads of the gods and use their powers against their will. Mm-hmm. Like, 
the sun god, I think. I don't remember which gods he killed, but all I remember is that he kills people. He used to. In God of War games, how many boss levels does he have to kill? I never thought of that. Like, on the very first one, when he's on a ship, I figure he he kills a, a Loch Ness monster. Yes. He does. And some other creature in some dungeon. Yep. But he, he killed every monster that was in his way. Even demons. And I do believe he's good with the ladies. If my servants doesn't correct me, I'm pretty sure. Cause I back in the day I saw a clip with two ladies and him in in the bed. I think he was good with the ladies. I think. Cause this is a rated R game. Now he's old. He has like a beard. He's bald. Actually, he's bald. <laughs> yeah, it's on the fucking. It's on the new video game over. <laughs> He's bald and he has a beard. <laughs> uh, he looks like fucking Wolverine at this point. He doesn't really have a Wolverine beard. I think he has like one of those type of beards that are like going down. <laughs> uh. <laughs> like a very like round beard, I think. It was like one of those type of round beards. Oh man. <sighs> Which type of beard it was though? It could be one of those like round beards. <laughs> I remember what like a round type of beard. I don't remember. Uh, any last anything about him before we wrap this up? <clears throat> Yeah, I do believe that in some of his games. Technically, he kills everything and has two different type of weapons now, even though he lost in the, the other weapons that he had are now gone, and now he holds Wilton Axe. A new game. Practically it. Well, that was good. Well, Matt, I'd like to thank you for being part of my show. And next time... And next time, this is Cartoon. Sign out. Say everybody in the next episode. See ya.